Good morning. This is North Carolina Prepper. And uh, a lot of people have been asking me about my um, my uh, survival bug out radio here. This is a Yesu VX7R. It's a very nice radio. Uh, it's waterproof or really weatherproof. You can actually play with this underwater or in the shower or the bathtub if you want, up to three feet for uh, 30 minutes, I think, rated. Um, <clears throat> it's a tri band radio, but the American version is a quad band. Um, you get dual receive and dual transmit. You get like a little repeater. It's got a, all kinds of colors and indicator strobes. Um, it's waterproof. It does the wires application for internet. Uh, the bands that works is um, 50, 50 megahertz, um, 144, and uh, 430. And the American version goes um, 220 megahertz. So that's pretty good. Um, I use it. It's easy to program. I use a cable and just do it on the computer, type it in. You screw everything in. Um, it's got a different antennas here that you change out for different bands. This one here will pretty much do everything except for the uh, six meter band, in which case you need another extension that you screw into here, and then you put the top on. That's for six meters, or uh, yeah, 50 megahertz. Um, that's basically the radio I use. It's got a magnesium case, so it's 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 tough. It's durable. It's not very big. Uh, I don't have a clip as a standard belt clip goes on here. I don't like it. I don't use it. Um, it has simultaneous uh, reception on two different bands or frequencies. Um, when you're monitoring, if one frequency comes on, the other one will like dim out the uh, or uh, fade a little bit. Um, let's see, it's got 900 channels for memory. Um, you can actually label the uh, thing charge. It's got a little bit of charge in it. You can actually go in here and label it and uh, look at the uh, scanner frequencies. It'll we'll actually label them. And like I said, it's got dual bands or a little indicator light when it transmits. I'm out of range of everything So, um, it's really good radio. I think everybody ought to get one. I think they have a new one now, a VX7 or VX8. I'm not sure. But this one is metal. It's waterproof. It comes in silver or black. Um, it's got a really good 64 uh, dot matrix display. It's easy to read. It's easy to program. You can just put in your frequency and go. Um, go back on here for a second. <sighs> It also does the, uh, let me get back where I can see what I'm doing here. It does the, uh, MRUS frequencies, our general radio, or that. It does the general radio mobile frequencies. It does the F, what is that? Oh, I can't see. FRS frequencies. It also does the CB frequencies. All the CB channels. You can put in whatever you want. It does weather. It does facts. It's got a frequency scanner, which is really nice. If there's a radio you have that you find that you don't know what frequency it's on, like a like a Motorola ones, the the block ones you, that are are like commercial, you can hold this up to it and key it, and it'll tell you what frequency it's actually running on. And then you can pair with that. You can it's really nice radio. I mean, you can go to the Yesu website and look it up. It's a Yesu Submersible, Submersible VX7R, and um, I think they're about three hundred dollars now, three fifty maybe. Not when I got it, but now they are. Um, it's a really easy radio for a prepper or beginner to use. This would be a great handy talkie for your first radio. It pretty much does everything except for sideband. And um, you can always upgrade from there on. You can do uh, it has an altimeter module that goes back here. You can the you can do the uh, frequency limiters and all the, like the hacks and stuff. You can do that with software on this one. Um, 
You just get the VX Commander software and say, I, I just want these frequencies. Okay, it's fine. And these are software things. So you don't have to actually physically modify your radio or cut limiters or cut bands or cut anything in there. So that's kind of nice. But like I said, go to the website, or go to Yasu's website and take a look at it. Look at the reviews online. Um, this is the radio I use in my bug out bag, my bug home bag, my hiking, my everything. Whenever I'm out and about and I want ham radio, it's great. It's really good radio. So there you go, North Carolina Prepper. Please rate and subscribe. And take a look at the VX7R. All right. Have a great day. Thank you.